Hello dancers, welcome back. This is uh, week two of our digital dance class for creative movement and I'm very excited that you are back again. I'm looking forward to dancing with you today. Um, we're gonna gather some things again. So this week, what you will need is some sort of stuffed animal or doll to share at the beginning of class. Uh, water, make sure you stay hydrated. So I've got my water bottle. And then the last thing we're gonna use today is something to use for like kind of like an obstacle course that we're going to create something to mark where we're going to skip and jump to so i just have a couple pieces of paper and i'm going to use my stuffed ball here so we need three different things it could be paper it could be stuffies it could be shoes just be creative make sure that it's okay with your family that you use it um, otherwise i think that's it so go gather those things and meet me back on the floor for sharing time and stretching Okay, here we go. Okay, are you back? Very good. So today what we're going to share is our name, of course, and our favorite flower. With so many things in bloom, it is really hard to pick a favorite thing. So you could pick a couple, um, or you can just pick what your favorite one is right now, which is what I'm going to do. So I'll go ahead and start, and then I'll give you a turn. My name is Miss Kristen. Uh, some of you call me Teacher Kristen. And my favorite flower right now is, probably flowers right now have to be the ones that I see blooming in the beautiful trees. So I've seen cherry trees and dogwoods, magnolia trees. There's lots of beautiful trees in bloom right now. So what is yours? What is your name and what is your favorite flower? Very good, awesome. Thank you so much for sharing. We're gonna go ahead and st set this aside and we'll use that soon, we'll use it again. And for now, we're gonna go ahead and start in butterfly position. So the soles of our feet together and these, our knees come out to make it look like butterfly wings. So let's go ahead and flap our butterfly wings. I'm looking forward to seeing some butterflies soon. We are actually growing some little sprouts of a plant called milkweed, and that's a plant that butterflies like, so I'm hoping the butterflies will come to us when we plant our milkweed out in the yard. And we're gonna go ahead and take a deep breath in and out and come in for a landing. Oh, that feels so good on my back. And in my hips. And we're gonna come back up. Good, let's flap our wings one more time. Where are we gonna fly to? Hmm, maybe we're gonna fly to a big field of flowers and we're gonna gather up some nectar. Are you ready? Deep breath in and out all the way over to get our drink of nectar and coming back up. Very good. All right, the next stretch we're gonna do today is we're gonna take our legs out into a straddle stretch. Now this is something we don't get to do in our class very often because we don't have the space but we do, we should have this space in our rooms and in our homes. So we're gonna open our legs up into a straddle stretch and we're gonna pretend to make a pizza. Do you like pizza? I like pizza. All right, so first we're gonna start with the dough. So everybody gather your dough and splat goes the dough in the center. And we're gonna get our rolling pin and we're gonna roll out the dough. Roll out your dough. You can make your pizza any shape you want. Mine might come out to be kind of like a flower shape since we're talking about flowers today. Very good. Oh, that feels good to get that stretch. All right, I'm gonna put that rolling pin away and I'm gonna grab some sauce. We need some sauce for our pizza. So I'm gonna come over to this foot. This is where I store the sauce and I'm gonna pull the sauce in, screw off the top and pour it on. There goes my sauce. Oh, it's looking more like pizza now. All right, put that aside. And let's see, what else do we need on our pizza? Cheese, we need cheese. Cheese is over here. Gather your cheese and pull it. Good, all right. We're gonna grate the cheese, or maybe it's in a bag and you just pour it from the bag, but we're gonna put our shredded cheese all over the pizza. Oh, very good. All right, set that aside. Hmm, now, here's the fun part. There's a whole bunch of different kinds of food all along the outside of our of our stretch area here. So maybe you like sausage or pepperoni or olives or peppers. 
layers, whatever you like on your pizza, you're gonna gather it up and put it on. All right, here we go. I'm gonna have a little bit of this. Good, what are you putting on your pizza today? And I'm gonna get a little bit of this. Good, share with us what you're putting on your pizza. Oh boy. All right, we better get it into the oven. Are you ready? We're gonna slide it all the way into our oven. Here we go, push into the oven. And we're gonna hold 10, nine, eight, seven, six, five, four, three, two, one, and pull it out, ding! Here it goes, give it a good, blow it off so we can cool it off. Cool it down. All right, I think we need to try it. Go ahead and cut it up, slice up your pizza. Good, and here we go, take a bite. Mm. Oh man, that's a good pizza. How's your pizza today? Very good. Are you ready to clean up? This is the best way to clean up. Here we go. Just like that. Like windshield wipers, we clean it up. Good, we're gonna shake out those legs and we're gonna do one more stretch today that we haven't done before in class because we have the space. So we're gonna lie down on our stomachs. Good, and we're gonna go ahead and put our hands on the floor just under our shoulders and we're gonna push all the way up, kind of like a snake. And back down. Good, let's try that again. Coming all the way up, push up and stretching into the back. And back down. Now this time we're gonna try and do it with no hands. So we're gonna come up, no hands. Oh, that's tricky. Can you take your arms out to the side? Good. Can you take your arms to the back? We're like superheroes. Ready, everybody fly. Very good. And back down. Oh, that felt really good. We're gonna come up and round it over. Get a good stretch through the back and roll all the way up. Very good. Okay, I think it's time to come to our feet and practice a couple of our moves that we've talked about. First one is gonna be first position. Do you remember first position? We're gonna start with our feet together and we're gonna slowly slide our toes open and it looks kind of like a slice of pizza or maybe a piece of pie. Good, we're gonna lift tall. So we're making a really tall straight line all the way through our body, up our spine, out the, the, uh, the crown of our head. Like we have a crown on our head and we're gonna lift through the center of the crown of that head. Shoulders are down. Belly is strong and arms are gonna come forward like a basket. Beautiful, look at that first position you're showing me today. All right, now we're gonna practice demi-plie, which means small bend. So we're gonna do three small bends, taking our knees out to the side, making a window. It's like a little diamond shape. Good, demi-plie. And let's do one more. Demi-plie, small bend, wonderful. Okay, so our final thing that we're gonna do is called a saute. Saute means to jump. Now, what if we try to jump without that plie that we just practiced? Let's try. Oh, that's so hard. How do you jump without a plie? Well, that's why we have to go back to that beautiful first position, that lovely soft plie that helps us cushion our fall and helps us to take off. Are you ready? One, two, three, saute. Oh, look, I landed like that too, so I can land softly. Let's try two more. Plie, saute, plie, stretch. Last one, plie, saute, plie, and stretch. Oh, lovely, let's shake it out. That was some good work today. All right, dancers, let's start moving. Let's do our animals. So we're gonna warm up our arms to start with our birds. Yes, I love your lovely birds. And maybe you have a little wings. Maybe you have big floating wings, whatever you'd like. All right, let me get some music on. Why don't you share with me what color your bird is today? Is your bird blue? Is your bird red? I don't know. What color is your bird today? All right, here's our bird music. I fitting. There it is. There it is. Can you hear it? All right, oh, there's those wings. We're gonna rise up on the balls of our feet. And go ahead, move like a bird all around your space. Beautiful. Oh, look at those birds. Maybe you have little flipping arms, little wings. Good. Beautiful birds. Maybe you're
you're soaring, like we've done before. Maybe you're a raptor of some sort. Very nice. Very good, birds. Hmm. All right, next we're gonna be a frog. Oh, that's gonna take a really big jump. I've been hearing some frogs out there, and we have some friends that have a bunch of tadpoles in their pond. So let's go ahead and be frogs. I think it's the right time of year. We're gonna crouch all the way down. Hands go to the, to the ground. Are you ready? Let me hear your best frog sound. Ribbit, and up, boing, boing, boing. Oh, look at those frogs. Boing, boing, <laughs> boing. Oh, that's good. Exercise on my legs. Boing. Oh, very good. All right, now what kind of animal would you like to be? I think, I think I'm gonna do some gallops today. But maybe you're something else. Maybe you're a really fast cat like a cheetah, or an elephant, or a sloth, and you're moving really slowly. What is your animal? And show me your animal. Show me your best animal. And freeze. Very good. All right, we better get our obstacle course going before we run out of time. I have my ball and I have my pieces of paper. Gather your things. I'm gonna go ahead and put one down. Now, yours don't have to look exactly like mine. We're just gonna space them out however it makes sense for your room that you are in, okay? And I'm making a little triangle. Oh, let's see, I don't think you can see that. Let me move this back. I'm gonna make a little triangle out of mine, okay? There we go. All right, now that we have everything placed, we're gonna go ahead and the first one, when we get to this first one, mine's the blue one is the first one for me. And I'm gonna stand on one foot. So I have to practice my balance. Having my focus straight ahead really helps me stay balanced. If I'm looking all around, it's really easy to lose that balance. So get your focus, slowly lift up one leg. And we're gonna practice hop, 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 hopping on that leg, and then we're gonna practice, practice hopping on that leg to our next spot. Hop, 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 hop. This takes me to my purple paper. Where does it take you? Good, now we're gonna switch to the other foot. Get our balance. We're gonna hop on one foot, go. Hop, 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 hop. And then I'm gonna take this hop all the way around to my last spot. Oh, that was great. Now we're gonna take turns hopping on both feet. So you only do one hop on each side. Hop, hop. And suddenly you might find that you're skipping. That's what we're doing. And we're gonna skip all the way around two times back to where we started. All right, let's try putting it all together. I'm gonna use my tambourine for music today. And you might find I go fast, you might find I go slow. You might find I stop and freeze. All right, so we're gonna start on one foot. Here we go. Ready, and. And travel to your next one. And freeze. Good, let's switch to the other side. Here we go. And travel. And freeze. Very good. Okay, now we're gonna try our skips around two times. Here we go. Each foot. Get the turn. And stop. Very good. All right, let's try it one more time. And listen, because it might get faster. Here we go. One foot. Ready. And. And just fun. And freeze. Switch feet. And one, two, three, four. Around. around, jumping over, leaping over, all of those things you can pause and you can do more. But we're gonna have to go ahead and finish up with our one last dance. So I'm gonna pick these up and you can follow me. We'll follow along for a little bit and then I'll give you some free time at the end of the song. 
Okay, let me get my music started. Ready? Oh, very good. It's been so fun moving with you today. Let's start by marching our feet. March. Very good. Let's press our heel forward. Heel. Heel. Dig that heel in. And push. 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 And roll. Can you roll those hands around on your right side? Now left side. Very good. We're going to sway our arms. Sway. on your hips. We're going to jump out and in. Out, in, out. All right, let's go faster. Out, in, out, in, out, in, out, in. Wow. Good job. And skipping around. Other way. All right, show me your moves. Whatever you want. This is your time to shine. Very good. Anything you want. Maybe you want to go low to the floor. Good. Maybe you want to go up fast and high. Anything you want. like to spin and go the other way so you don't get dizzy. Take your arms up and down. Roll those shoulders back. Shake those hands out. Take a bow. Good. Maybe you want to do a curtsy. Curtsy. Oh, you guys were so good today. Thank you so much for dancing on dancing and I'll be back with another video soon. Bye!